welcome so let's go ahead and start working on the Google Maps API console and you guys can see that right in here just simply write that Google Map API console and search for that in here click upon that Google Maps API and make sure that you guys are logged in with your Gmail account so here we are right on the dashboard for Google Cloud and make sure that you guys are logged in with your Gmail account now first we will go and create a project from here create a new one from here and one more thing I have already created this project so these are the old ones now we will go and create a new one in here we will now just give the name my Google Map API series right after this click upon that create so this will just create a new project for you guys you guys can see that my Google Map API series that first one just now now we will go ahead towards the APIs and services click upon that and make sure to select in here your new project that we just created a while ago that one okay right on the top my Google map API series click upon that all just fine now so go down in here and click upon that go to the Google Maps platform successfully now built now in here you will just click upon that maybe letter here we are again right in the dashboard so we will go to words now APIs and services click upon that here we are and you guys can see all of the services that Google Map provide okay now you guys can simply just select that from here maps SDK for Android and you can simply search right in here in the search bar you simply write that name okay copy it and paste it in here you guys can see that okay maps SDK for Android click upon that and you guys can see that we have already enabled that API okay enabled and in your case if it didn't enable then it will show to you guys the enable button right in here then simply click upon that enable it will just enable the API and you guys can also read the documentation so it will tell you that our purposes we will use that maps as you for Android okay now let's go ahead and click upon that manage here we are right in the dashboard so now we will go towards the credentials click upon that keys and credentials and so we have successfully just created the API key and you guys can see that right in here now simply come here and click upon that show key here we go with our API key okay you simply copy that from here and close it so basically that's it for this video and right from the next video we will be working right in the Android studio and we will use that API key 
in our project just to connect our project that one my Google map API series we will connect that right in the Android studio with this specific key so that's it see you in the next one